Mr. Turner. Oh, hi, and, and you are? Greg Hancock, Director of Finance. Of course, Mr. Hancock. Please, call me Greg. Yeah, Hancock. Hancock, 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 Hancock. Hancock Greg, here we go. Been with us since 2008. Wow, 10 years. It's pretty amazing. So what brings you here today? Just wanted to welcome the new Director of HR. Thanks, please, have a seat. I have to say, I was surprised Mr. Mitchell chose someone so young for this position. Really? And why is that? Well, Mr. Mitchell, he's always been, you know, old school. Mm-hmm. Old school? He told me about your philosophy. Uh, what do you call it? Your uh, gut force philosophy? It's very interesting. Yeah, I mean, don't get me wrong, a candidate's her qualifications are important, but I tend to go with my gut. She had to let me down. I see. I guess it's a good quality. You guess? Uh-huh. And I see you're a note taker. Another good quality. Allow me to ask a company veteran like yourself a question. Of course. Happy to share my experience. If you were a caterpillar in a cocoon, would you come out a butterfly or a moth? I'm sorry. Sorry. Mm-hmm. I suppose I would be, uh... And if you had a superpower, what would it be? Is this that new personality test Mr. Mitchell was talking no. about? Answer the question, please. Well, I never really thought about it. Mm-hmm. And if you had access to all the financial accounts and could take money out and hide it, would you? I do have access to all the accounts. I'm the head of the finance department. Greg, 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 Greg. I'm sorry, but I'm gonna have to let you go. Let me go? Oh, Mr. Mitchell said you had a weird sense of humor. I don't, and I'm not joking now. Excuse me, you're firing me? You can't do that. Yes, I can. No, you can't. I can if I have Mr. Mitchell's approval. And do you have his approval? No. Well, good luck getting it. Wait, wait, wait. I'm only joking. You're not really fired. That's just how I interview new candidates. Except for I don't fire them because they've not got the job yet. I just tell them to get the hell out of my office. And if they run, I don't call them again. But if they stand up to me, then they get a second interview. I see. Hey, do you know where the bathrooms are around here? Uh, down the hall on the left. Thanks. And you, my friend, would get a second interview. <laughs>